Welcome to Underground LA. Today we're going to take a look at the final resting place of Milton Rudin. I wanted to give a shout out to all the new subscribers. We're uh, reaching 2,000, so I appreciate everybody's support. Milton Rudin was born in 1920 in New York. He went to law school at Harvard Law, and then he got his start in Hollywood representing a lot of uh, people in the entertainment field that were trying to avoid being blacklisted during the 1950s and the Senator McCarthy hearings. He was so well known around Hollywood uh, that people just referred to him as Mickey. His uh, other nickname was The Judge because he was in four um, different movies. My uh, roommate in college um, always told me that that was his uh, uncle every time we would see Mickey Rudin on TV, but uh, I didn't have Google, so I never, uh, never quite believed my roommate at the time, so I apologize for that. Milton uh, Rudin was so successful that he um, had uh, such stars as Lucille Ball, uh, Norman Lear, Liza Minnelli, Marilyn Monroe, and Frank Sinatra. He um, was one of the first people on the scene during at the time of Marilyn Monroe's death. He uh, did the divorce for uh, Frank Sinatra and Mia Farrell, and he was, was the one who first contacted um, Frank Sinatra about Ava Gardner's death. He spent... Uh, Many years defending Frank Sinatra and his ties to the Mafia. He died in 1999 um, in Beverly Hills, and he is an interned at um, Pierce Brothers in Westwood. Like, subscribe, and tell me who else you want me to see.